All right, well, happy Saturday, everyone. We've been here for now, what, five days, five full, well, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, four full days, a little bit of Monday. So this is really the beginning of day five in the new home. And we've got some developments. I'll let you in on those. Today's gonna be an interesting day. Uh, it's gonna be a little different than other days because today, unlike previous days this week, at this point, we've got most of the major furniture on order. In fact, the big update for today is that yesterday we did order the dining set for the dining room and a TV stand for the living room, and those are also being delivered on July 6th. Um, and so we're really set in the basics, basis of you know furniture-wise and, and all that. The only things that are really left at this point are rugs to put down on the floor to stop some of this echoing that you hear crazily. Um, also, we need a desk for Leanna's office so she can sit down and, uh, and you know, hopefully eventually do some work. And uh, we also need a few odds and ends. You know, uh, every once in a while, I, put, I wrote them down here. Yeah, I need shorts. My shorts don't fit me anymore. I haven't worn them since last year. They don't fit me. I have a recycling bin. You know, different little, little random things for the place. Uh, and so it's coming together, but we don't need to run around and make major purchases today. So what we've decided to do today is a few things. First of all, we are doing our very first batch of clothes in the new washer. When I say we, and when I say we, I should mostly say Leanna is doing it because I did not touch this. Yeah, damn straight. You didn't, you didn't even sort your stuff. Look at that. Look how cool that is. You can see it washing as it washes. <coughs> You see it spin. And it lights up. It has a hundred different light up settings here. You can adjust settings, the temperature, the, the level of soil, and the spin speed, which I think is kind of badass. This is really nice. And this we're wearing a cold wash on these clothing. You can also do you know warm wash different ones. Mm -hmm. The dryer is pretty much the same. These are almost brand new. And so I'm very surprised that when we moved in here that we got you know, the level of appliances that we did. These are like literally brand new and these are really, really well done. LG is a brand that I trust. I've had many different apply or not appliances, but televisions and electronics and things of LG never had a problem. So I'm very much hoping that these uh, turn out well. I'm thinking it will. I don't see why it wouldn't, right? Mm -hmm. So we got our first batch of clothes washing. Now, later today, we're gonna do two things. In fact, one thing we may be doing sooner rather than later is we may actually be doing a Skype session with my parents. And I'm going to take my iPad and walk it all around the condo. Not the condo, the townhouse. I keep calling it a condo because I'm so used to living in Connecticut in a condo. This is a townhouse. Walking it around the townhouse, showing them, you know, how it's set up so far. I have no idea what quality that's going to be. We're going to be using the wireless internet, so it could be very, you know, iffy or wonky depending. Uh, later today, we're thinking about doing our very first live stream, and I'm going to announce that on Twitter shortly, of course, by the time you watch this video, because we upload these later in the day, you'll probably already have been too late to, to see the stream, but we are going to do a live stream. I'm thinking I'm going to do it from my office, and the reason I want to do it from my office is because I actually want to test the quality of the internet in the office. That's going to be my business internet that I'm using to do my work, so if we connect and we stream and there's no problems, no frame drops, that's a great sign. If we connect and we find, oh, it's not as fast as they said it was, and we're having frame drops and issues, then you know that's gonna be a problem. So we'll see, we're gonna do that later today. I'm gonna announce that on Twitter. And then finally, I did have a chance to finally talk with the president of the Condo Association. And uh, I gave him the information in regards to getting a gate code set up. And basically what that means is, as, you, as I've told you guys before, this is a private gated community. You cannot get in without permission of someone letting you in or a gate code uh, or one of these handy dandy guys, the clickers, which open the front gate, okay? So what they're gonna do is program in my new home phone number into the gate. When someone drives up, they're gonna see, oh, Bur Burnell will be on the panel. They dial Burnell and it dials to me, and I'll get a call here on my home phone. I'll be able to pick it up, confirm who it is, and if it's someone who I want to let in, I hold down a certain button and it just opens the gate for them. So I will not have to be you know, giving out my personal gate code, which is horrible, and you should not be doing that. I won't have to run up to the gate, which is on the other side of the freaking you know, facility here. 
uh, community. Every time someone shows up, I'll be able to just let them in easily. So today's agenda is a little bit more laid back. I'm sure we'll be going out at some point. Every day we've been going out to buy odds and ends and do things. But uh, I think today's agenda is a little bit more laid back. Leanna, by the way, is feeling much better. She says she has no more congestion nor sore throat. Yeah, just a tiny bit of a nose run, but it's like nothing. Yeah. So in that regards, no problems. And, uh, you know, it's going to be more of a, let's get settled in a little bit more. Let's try the internet out with Skype and with, uh, with streaming. We'll probably go out later for food, I'm thinking. And uh, for odds and ends, like I said, here we've got odds and ends to grab today. At some point, we do have to go shopping to get any shorts that fit. But outside of that, I think we're pretty much set until, uh, you know, until things actually start getting delivered this week. Oh, one other thing. The, uh, the moving company called me and said that they need a money order. Uh, they will not accept a credit card when they show up on Thursday. So I have to get the, I emailed them back. I'm like, that's great, but you have to tell me who to make the money order to. Is it the name of your company? Is it something else? Or who could give them cash. Yeah, I really want to have like $4,000 in cash on my person. You know, a big giant wad of money <laughs> coming out of my, my freaking pockets. So. so yeah, so that's today. We'll hope to have more vlogs for you later. Okay. And, uh, that is it.